waiting in line for 35 minutes. We've made it 14 inches, which is more than I can give any woman at any time. That's horrible. <laughs> Across Oktoberfest, and who did we find but Frank Fritz? I'm from Davenport, Iowa. Yep. This is my 34th Oktoberfest. Um, I used to come up here, ride my motorcycle, I used to camp out on Goose Island. I always eat every single time at the Hungry Peddler. I got to put in my contract that I have this weekend off. Oh my God, that is amazing. Well, it's 11:01. Uh, the tapping of the golden keg ceremony has just started, and here we are sitting in queue, exactly where we wanted to be. This is where all the action is, really. We've now learned a lesson. We're going to get down here a little bit earlier next year. Boy, boy, boy. Rose, happy fest. So here we are at Lacrosse Oktoberfest, and we missed the tapping of the keg because the line was 18 miles long. It took us 47 minutes to get through. Um, so everything that we wanted to shoot, we didn't. Hello, sir. How are you enjoying Oktoberfest? So we're here at Alligator or Shrimp on a Stick. This is something we wanted to try last year that we came and we weren't able to. So this is our first stop before the beer. That is larger than anything I've seen on a stick. I mean, seriously, I've seen a lot of shit on a stick. That's the biggest. And this is Alligator on a Stick. Oh my God. Come on now. If you all have a chance to come down here and get some alligator and stick, I think you should. So if you haven't had a gyro, you're out of your mind. You need to get your on, or a hero. I don't know how people say it. I say it my way. What do you guys like the most about uh, coming around to these festivals and uh, handing out great food? Yeah, different people. Meeting yeah, different people? Took the words right out of my mouth. I travel around for work a lot, and so I get to eat out a lot. And I'm telling you, closest heroes, this is not a paid advertisement, but I'm telling you, man, they're the best heroes. What did you get there, sir? Uh, these are some uh, smoked uh, burnt brisket ends, and they smell and taste amazing. I finally found the golden keg. What I didn't know is I was walking around. Sir, what's your name? Ian Young. Well, sir, I really enjoy that you uh, dressed up today. What gave you the idea? I just like dressing up and making people happy. Well, it looks like you're very happy, matter of fact. Somebody already broke it. Well, you know what? Tell them to use a little lube and be a little more gentle with you, right? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Not only does Oktoberfest have beer, uh, alligator, burnt ends, a uh, plethora of people, but they have so much fun down here. We have talked to so many people and everyone's really nice and kind. Best place to have Oktoberfest so far. What are you doing today? I'm doing great. How are you, sir? Not bad at all. What are you drinking today? I think this is Oktoberfest. Well, I don't know, I'm drunk. <laughs> oh, what? Well, drunk already, that one? Don't worry about it, don't worry about it. How long have you been drinking? What day is it? <laughs> January. January. That's Wisconsin for you. We start in January, we don't end until January. Return to the Golden Keg. And I'm a Star Wars guy, so that's kicking <laughs> All right, thank you, sir. It has a nice frothy head. And who doesn't like a little head, right? <laughs> It is really light. It doesn't stay on the palate very long and crisp. And there's a zing to it I can't place. Andy might be able to. So I'm gonna give this a try for the first time. There's actually not much taste to it. It's kind of like drinking like a little bit of a flavored water. This tastes very similar to that baba that we've had on the show. Not bad, I'll drink her up to Oktoberfest. Let's get wasted, it's drunk. Oktoberfest, yeah! Happy Oktoberfest! And how long have you been drinking for today? Uh, 8 a.m. <laughs> it's such a loaded question, but we get the honest answers. People have been drinking since 6 o'clock, 4 o'clock. It's, it's amazing. How long have you been drinking for? Um, since like 10. That is a running theme. We all start early on Oktoberfest, don't we? Yeah. Two years ago, I interviewed you at that beer tent over there, right? That's, That's right. True. And uh, has your thoughts changed about Oktoberfest whatsoever? Uh, no, not whatsoever. Still just as drunk. So, two years later, still just as drunk. So what's your favorite part about Oktoberfest? Oh, it's definitely drinking all day. I mean, you can't, you can't drink all day if you don't start in the morning. So you're the fest master. What's that mean? Uh, ceremonial head of this whole Oktoberfest organization. Yeah. I don't do the work. I just uh, bring cheer, gamete-like, 
kite uh, represent us at formal events, so uh, it's it's a ceremonial job, but I love it. And how did you get into that role? You have to be 55, you have to be married, live in the city of La Crosse, and an active community uh, civic obligations, and I've been all of those things, and somebody nominated me, the rest is history. And you seem to be surrounded by good-looking women the whole time. It's been a really one of the side benefits of the job. Oh, yeah, and, you know, I get to... Get, pin them with a button, and sometimes they get a hug, sometimes a kiss. Hey, you can't go wrong with that at all. Matter of fact, I want your job. <laughs> I think uh, tap in them for the golden cake. Yeah. That's excellent. Can't be better than the golden cake, holding that thing right above you saying, oi, 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 oi! I think the people, the people are wonderful, yeah. Uh, it's a good day not to work. <laughs> The people. People? People. That is like a running theme, I gotta say. Enjoying each other, meeting new people, making new friends. Just a great scene. Tapping the golden keg. Can't beat it. The parade, the Oktoberfest grounds, I just, I love it. It's just fun. Just all the people coming together from different cultures and drinking beer. The beer. The beer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like drinking on the street and not being harassed by cops, so that's always a plus. Good for the community, oh, I think. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it brings everyone together. Yeah, it really has, hasn't it? Yeah. Beer. The beer, the wild women, the wild women, the ripping beer. and the My outfit oh. is my favorite part. Yeah, the outfit's wonderful. I was going to wear the same thing. I'm glad I didn't, though. Beer. 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 Well, probably the drinking and the bratwurst are probably my two favorite things about it. Yeah. I'd say the people. Uh, drinking. Drinking, yes. And you've been doing a little bit of that, I take it. A lot of it, yes. Oh. Uh, the beers, hanging out with your friends. You always see people you haven't seen in a long time. It's always awesome. No, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the first time I've heard pussy, to be honest. The people. The people, absolutely. And the beer. And the beer. Drinking. <laughs> no kids. Oh, you can't beat that now. That's no right. Mom, so it's like a day without the kids. Yeah, and a good day at that. Right? Uh, probably the Maple Leaf. Maple Leaf. We love Oktoberfest. It's a good time. Nice family atmosphere. Love my friends. Having a good time. Yeah. And that's what it's all about. Right now, hanging yeah. with these guys. Yeah? Yep. Y'all having a good friends. time? Family and friends. Y'all barbecuing out, too? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mustard. <laughs> <laughs> that is the first time we've ever heard mustard ever, yeah. The people? The, the people. liquor. The people, yep, and the liquor. Can't be the Just the enjoyment, man. Um, I love socializing, everyone coming together, having a good time. It's it's a wonderful atmosphere. Beer. Beer. <laughs> so how long have you been doing caricatures? Ten years. Ten years. And what do you like the most about it? Um, I like the drawing, and I love to draw, and I like people. So yeah. Can't beat it either way, right? Right. Yeah. yeah. So do you come to Oktoberfest every year? Uh, it was my first year. Believe it or not, yeah. it's my first year. And how are you enjoying it so far? Having a great time. Yeah. yeah. Everyone is so nice. Like, yeah. you'll meet people six years older than you, and they are loving Oktoberfest, and yeah. they've been here for the last. Wait, did you say six years older than you? 60. Thank God, because I feel really old all of a sudden. <laughs> I'll tell you what. So you're a brewer. I am. I, I, I work in the brewing department at City Brewery. Yeah. And what's your name? I'm sorry. Jared Basil. Jared, nice to meet you. So how many Oktoberfests have you made? Uh, I was 21, so I'll be last 16 years. Wow, that's great. And what do you like most about brewing the beer? Uh, just the fact that I can see people drinking it and have a good time with it. I mean, this past uh, last two years, we finally got uh, Pabst to agree to brew Old Style Oktoberfest back in La Crosse. And Old Style is where the Oktoberfest originated was. It was with the Old Style label, so it's great to see people drinking it. This is my first one, and it ain't gonna be my last. That's I can tell you that. Not my first. All right. But it's not my second. Oh no, how many is it? 13. Lived here since I was four. 26 now, so uh, pretty much 22. I marched in nine parades. 24. Oh. Just kidding, not 24. I don't know. I've lost count so far. A lot. Yeah. I moved here in 1988, so I've made a lot. I stopped counting. That's a good idea. I, I did the same thing. 13? Holy sh you gotta think that long, absolutely, yeah. Enough. <laughs> I like that. I've been drinking at Oktoberfest since my freshman year. So. <laughs> I don't know if we should have to get. So, yeah. Well, I'm 33 and I've been to 31 out of 33 Oktoberfest. Holy cow. Right? Yeah, you're like a veteran of Oktoberfest. I am. I moved here from the West Coast in 1978, so I've been here every year since 1979. Why did you bring your lunch on a, on a necklace? Uh, 
kind of one of those things that you munch on when you're like really hammered and you want to have something to just sober you up a little bit. This probably is my favorite place to talk to people. It really is. Great folk, very welcoming. Although I definitely see the two different types of people, the ones that want to be on camera and the ones that don't want to be on camera. Oktoberfest. But up here, not down there. Are you eating? Oktoberfest. Just a small town girl living in a lonely world. He took the midnight train going anywhere. Not only do we meet a huge amount of different people and it's a wonderful Oktoberfest, we also see a huge amount of different vehicles. Driving safe is very important at Oktoberfest. And here we see this smart car. Now, I don't know how smart it really is to drive something that's a coffin on wheels. It may be great, but I'm afraid that if I fart right now, it will fly across the county and hit some poor cow later on. So I represent this company called Case of the Caribbean. We develop a lot of Jamaican jerk sauce, yes. a lot of dry rubs. Oh. I'm looking forward to bringing you guys some German jerk chicken. Oh, I am all about it next year. You are going to be my man next year. Thank you very much. Someone's having a good time, aren't they? What's your name? Tia. Tia, and how many Oktoberfests have you made? Oh gosh, the past six. I was a past Miss Lacrosse Oktoberfest in 2012. Wow, really? And what's your favorite part about Oktoberfest? I honestly, I love tapping, but I love the Maple Leaf Parade. And if you're in the parade, coming over the viaduct and seeing the crowds of people lining the street into downtown is a surreal moment. I tear up. It's just great. Yeah? It's probably the greatest party in the world. Boobies. Yeah, you can't really beat boobies. Why wouldn't you? Right. The camaraderie. Ah, very good. It is a wild party. Why would you not come down here? Good scenery. Everybody needs to get to Oktoberfest. It's the best time ever. Drink beer, hang out with friends. Yeah. Unlimited respect, Oktoberfest. Safe community, good people, good fun. Everybody loves them one another. You don't have to be German. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to like pretzels, but you definitely have to like beer. It is so much fun. Whatever cliche or click you're into, they've got it here. Come down and have a good time. It's awesome. The beer. That's it. And well, more beer. <laughs> you need to get your ass down here. It's amazing. Say that. Oh, We're you need to get bleep your butt down here. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah, we'll catch that in editing. And what's your name? Robbie. And how long have you owned this establishment? Uh, one and a half days. I'm sorry. One and a half days? Yeah, we opened yesterday. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so are you from around here? Chicago. What's your favorite part about Oktoberfest? People. Yeah. People. Yeah. People. People are awesome. How's it going for you so far? Good. I knew, I mean, I bartended before downtown, so I knew what I was getting into. Um, it just happened to be that we opened when it was Oktoberfest. What is with the curtain? This is a special lounge for VIP customers only. Really? And how do you become a VIP customer? No idea. Son of a I'm VIP all of a sudden. Oh, look at this. Wow. I don't know, Andy, but this is really nice. If this is what VIP is, we need to get VIP a lot more. Look at this guy. He's been Oktoberfesting up way too much. I can see why everyone uh, yesterday was saying that they love coming to Lacrosse for Oktoberfest. It is really friendly. It's really warm. People are always kind and just want to have a good time. Hi! Y'all having a good time today? Yeah. Uh, did you get a lot of candy? Kind of. Not enough, though, huh? No. I bet your parents would be happy about that, huh? You having a good time? Yeah! What's your favorite part so far? Bands and candy, you heard it here. What's your favorite part of the parade? Um, I'm not sure yet. Yeah, you getting a bunch of candy? Sorta. Yeah. You want some more candy? Yeah! Of course, who doesn't? Are you having a good time? Yeah! What's your favorite part? Uh, probably this band. That band's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. I, like I love getting beads! Yes, the beads are fun, aren't they? You guys got a lot of beads. I like the marching bands. Yeah, I like really, the band. They're doing yeah. a really good job this year. Yeah, they have, haven't they? I've been impressed. The parade! It's yeah. awesome! Yeah, look at all these beads! That's awesome. What's your favorite part about the parade so far? The candy, definitely. <laughs> Do you have a favorite float? Um, The Law Wrestling one. Oh, yeah? You a wrestler? Yep. Holy cow! You kicked my butt, couldn't you? Yep. <laughs>
Well, what's your favorite part about the parade so far? The beer. Family! Family! Well, my family's oh, always yeah. with me. Oh, yeah. And the beer's not? No. Even the young ones get drunk and pass out. It's horrible. <laughs> Would you look at the sack on this Ford? Turn your head and cough, sir. Dusty Lawn, is that I'm, your real name? That's an Ooh. awesome name. I'm loving it. Yeah, what's your favorite part so far? The Central Marching Band. Probably all the bands that play the good songs, you know, like the late 80s, for sure. All right, what are you all drinking today? Um, orange juice. Uh, water. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if that looks like orange juice and water. Happy October Fest of Cross! I'm doing it. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I did the way. Security? Are you running security? Uh, yeah, I'm a beer collection officer. Now, is that after the beers are drank or before the beers are drank so you can drink them? Yes. I thought so. Oh, we got News 19. We're giving them a run for their money. <laughs> how, how are those robbers treating you? More comfortable He's than more uh, comfortable those articles clothes that I own. Really? It's funny because they want me to wear one of them. I told them no. Hey, throwing on, there's plenty of women for all of us. Yeah. <laughs> Gentlemen, I was actually told to come over and talk to you all because you have something going on with these t-shirts. What's going on here? You know, well, we're just trying to... I don't know. You know, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sign it. Go Just ahead. sign it. I have literally been here for years. This is my favorite tradition. If anyone around the world has never heard of it, they need to and they need to come. I can't do that wave. I'm giving it up. Are you going to be here next year? Heck yeah. Different shirts, same shirts. Different shirts. Same pretzels or different pretzels? Same pretzels. <laughs> we got a mixed bag on that one. We like to party in Wisconsin, it seems like. Every weekend, there's something somewhere. Hey, out there. And what's your favorite part about the fest? Oh my god, the parade, really? I mean, how can you not? <laughs> so what made you decide to put a bar inside of a horse trailer? Because that just makes sense. Absolutely. What are you going to put in there, a horse? <laughs> yeah, who would want to do that? Where did the concept come from, though? Pinterest gone wild. Really? Yes. Yeah. How long did it take you to do? Couple months. Really? Yeah. And is it a fully stocked bar? It is. Right at the camera. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That was great. You gonna be back next year? Yeah. Hey, yeah. All right. What's your favorite part so far? The beer. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? What's your favorite part? Actually, I was really enjoying the marching bands today. Was it good? Oh God, yeah, right. You missed it. You missed it. Well, I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> Andy, how are you enjoying the, uh, the Oktoberfest? I'm having a great time. With this camera in your hand, it definitely feels like you have VIP access. <laughs> it really does. So how y'all enjoyed the uh, the parade? Did you enjoy it? Awesome. Guys, yeah. I got five koozies. No sh What are you guys going to do now that the parade's done? Where are you going now? Drink more. Uh, Drinking. We're going to binge drink somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> there you are. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all have a great day now. How y'all doing today? Doing good, man. We living life, man. Getting, I'm enjoying it. We enjoying life. Getting f***ed up, too. <laughs> This is what America should be like all the time. And it could be. People, you know, stop being jerks. <laughs> some of the best food down here at Oktoberfest, some of the best brews, some of the best people. If you ever, ever decide to go to Oktoberfest and you don't want to fly to Germany, La Crosse, Wisconsin is the place to be. I tell you that. I'm going to try mine first. Mm, that is not bad. That is not bad. Just picked up uh, six tickets, $20. We're going to go over and get ourselves some Surly Brewing brews here. Dusty's going to try it out first. See you then. Oh, I'm Dusty Long. Long. Yeah, long. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's horrible. Your last name's really short. Well, <laughs> the rest of me ain't, though. So. <laughs> that's 2017, everyone ain't. Okay. Cameraman, <laughs> turn around. Come on, come on. Look at this. What is this right that's here? That's Oktoberfest. <laughs> wait, wait, we only got lucky if there's 
one down here. Well, I can't show that off. Yeah, is that is that a, is that a hickey? Is that a hickey on your neck? Oh my God! No matter what happens, oh, I'm proud of you. I, I'm, I mentally I'm 12, so it works. <laughs> I'm not much of a beer drinker. I'm a recovering alcoholic. I am too. I'm recovering right now. All right. All right. Recovered. <laughs> recovered. Here we are standing in line again because Oktoberfest is about queuing up and waiting. It's like being back in the military. Hurry up and wait, hurry up and wait, hurry up and wait. October, what is it, 2017? It is. October <laughs> 2017, baby. Da -da -da -da. I love big oh. boobs and I cannot lie. Oh, These oh, other brothers can't deny. Oh, Please do not put that on TV. Oh, it's too late. Yeah, it's B-roll. <laughs> what news station is this? Oh, it's not a news station. We're a YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. We're news, all right. Only the best we're news here. We're YouTube. Yeah. YouTube is kind of naughty sometimes. Well, no, that's uh, Pornhub. But, yeah, it's about the same. Who gave you your hickey? Oh, well. <laughs> you aren't the only ones that were partying last night. Uh, free come Sunday. Coming up hot and coming out soft. <laughs> Sir. Even in Oktoberfest, there is sadness. There was once beer being served here, I believe, but it has run dry, and now it's a sad remembrance of what could have been. That's all we know how to do is drink. Holy <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he doesn't even put it in the glass. There's this nice little sliver here, if you can see that, and I think we can fit, and if we go me, then Dusty, then Andrew behind me, We'll all see over each other, and it'll be good. Watch yourself. Stop. All right, go. <laughs> what I have to do, what you guys don't know, is that Andy's walking backwards most of the time, and i got to give him directions, which is really bad, because if I say right, he's going to go the other way than I want him to go. i got to constantly remember that. Kids, I mean, I don't know if he has to pee or if he's just excited to see you. Oktoberfest, La Crosse, Wisconsin. That's what's up. Be there, because it's Yes, for sure. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I shine like a lighthouse, I tell you what. When I was in the military, that's what they had me use. I just stood on the beach going, bong. I bet you my Fitbit would be going nuts right now is how much walking we've done in two days. I'd be like, holy shit, you fat I can't believe you did that. You kids want the cars more than anybody else. There's one. And there's one. And there's one. For those of you that have not made it to the end of the parade, this is the end. We got, it is a U-Haul, a cop. And then everyone just crowds the streets and starts going back to the festivities because there's still a lot going on today.